Hi, I'm Jesse David Eisenberg with the JDE Law Firm. I'm a business litigation attorney, which means that my business is to protect your business. I'm coming to you today with coronavirus video number three, which means that because I've been ordered to be home, I'm working from home for the time being. That's why you see my lovely garage behind me. Uh, today I want to talk about what costs can you expect in, uh, uh, in your lawsuit. But first I want to say if you have any questions about what you're going to hear today, you can go to meetjde.nyc and we can discuss what we hear today, what about your business, or we can discuss a potential case. And all you have to do is go to that website to book a 10 minute phone, or once this pandemic is over, a 30 minute in-person consultation. Now, what cost can you expect from a lawsuit? So your first cost is gonna be your filing fee, okay? So in New York, in Supreme Court, that's $210. And again, these, these costs are gonna be New York costs because they're the ones I know off the top of my head. So you have the filing fee, then you have the process server fee. You have to serve the defendant or defendants. Now it can be as cheap as $75, depending on the process server, if you only have one defendant. If you have multiple defendants, it could be a few hundred dollars. Now, a cost that you can incur, but it's a little rare, is called a skip trace. You pay a process server a fee, usually around $100, and that's if you don't know where the defendant lives. So they conduct a skip trace to try and locate the defendant. Now, once the defendant has been served and you filed, the next fee really is gonna be your request for judicial intervention. What that means is that you've gotta pay money to have a judge assigned to your case. Again, in New York, that's about $95. Another fee you could incur is a motion fee. That's $45 per motion in New York. And then you have a deposition fee or fees. So when you depose the other side, you have to pay for it. And that can be as cheap as about $125 or it could run into many hundreds of dollars, or if it's a really long deposition, it could be even be around a thousand. But depends on the length of the deposition. Another fees you might incur are expert witness fees. They generally range from a thousand dollars to tens of thousands of dollars, depending on the complexity of the case. Another fee you could end up having, besides an expert witness, and besides the deposition fees, you may have to pay another court reporter to get a transcript of something that happened either in a motion or at trial. And then you, it's possible you can have, you know, if you have to file an appeal or the other side files an appeal, you can have appellate costs. Obviously you have legal fees to add as well. So just to conclude the types of costs you can have in your lawsuit, you can have the filing fee, the process server fee, the motion fee, the judge fee, expert witness fees, deposition fees, court reporter fees. Now there could be, depending on the case, there are other possible fees, um, but these are the main fees in a civil litigation or business litigation case. Now, if you want to discuss this, uh, or you want to discuss your business, or you think you have a potential case, all you have to do is go to meet jde.nyc. That's M-E-E-T J-D-E dot N-Y-C. And you can book that 10 minute phone or 30 minute in-person consultation with me. Once again, I'm Jesse David Eisenberg with the JDE Law Firm. I'm a business litigation attorney, which means that my business is to protect your business. Thanks for watching and listening.